Hello and welcome back to the second part of this tutorial. Um, so part two. Um, now my settings in this part. So dock settings. So first of all, my language is English because that's the only language I speak properly. Um, run up startup. Um, store settings in portable I, um, I and I single user thing. Um, minimize windows to dock. So it means it minimizes it to this bit here. Disable minimize animations. I leave it off. It just means like if you minimize something, it does the animation. Um, running application in case. See how I'm running Camtasia Recordia so it has that little black arrow down there. Good. Um, Opening running application instance and lock items. So I've only got like five of them checked. Icons. High quality icons. It says it's slower but my computer is pretty fast. Opacity. Opacity means if I put it on 100 it's visible a lot. If I bring it down you'll see less and less of the dock unless you've got it on the thing but it looks kind of faint compared to that uh... size the size doesn't really matter i have it on 21 px which is pixels um... only because if i... I'd, i want some room um... if i zoom uh... see how it kind of expands on the left side here um yeah so um if you've got a little only a little bit of stuff and make it bigger it's huge um depends on how how much stuff you have on it Zoom bubble, zoom 40 pixels, zoom width 4, um, means 4 icons, zoom duration 199 milliseconds, position, uh, in the position, so that was 199 milliseconds back there if you missed that, position, um, screen position, bottom, um, you can make it at the top, so it appears up here, or the left, or the right, or the bottom, or the bottom, so yeah. Layers, normal, or always on top, but I always have this normal. Centering, put it at 0%, because it will be in the center. If you change it, it will just go from side to side. Edge offset means how far away it is from the edge. See how it appears up here. And it changes. Okay. Star. Um, my custom version of Vista Black because I made this theme from a theme called Vista Black on here. Except I changed the colors and a bit of the outline, the star and all that stuff. But I used it as a template. No, I edited it in Photoshop. You can download more themes from the Rocket Dot website as I showed you in the part one. I'll just scroll through all the themes to show you. Some of these I've downloaded, some of them came with the uh, Rocket Dot. So I'll just go back up. Okay. Um, the sad black on labels means it doesn't show a label, like it doesn't say Microsoft Excel, but if I untick that, it will be Microsoft Excel 2003. Um, 
I always have that on tick so because I like to see the name. That shows you what the font and preview thing is there, where it's, you know, it says iTunes here. Um, yeah. Behavior. Um, bounce, attention, uh, icon attention effect, bounce, auto hide, um, auto hide duration 246, auto hide delay 246, pop up delay, um, zero milliseconds, and I've pop up over mouse over on mouse over and yeah you can update it by clicking the update button on the about bit and this forums debug info and yeah and tells you what version number it is and yeah um yeah so that's that was my settings um e um I'll show you this program in action now see how the taskbar is showing up and does this sometimes. You click that. And it disappears straight away. Click it again. It appears again. And it disappears. Um, got a clock there. You can change the clock to any icon can be a clock. You screw icon settings. I've downloaded a couple of clocks. But yeah, these are all my icons. All them. So yeah, that's my current clock. There's a default clock and all that, but yeah. Um, yeah, that's about it. Um, I hope you're liking my Visual Basic 2008 tutorials. Um, tutorials and um, uh, more tutorials will be coming out soon. Okay. Yeah.